So taking a look at what's going on in the tropics, we're getting closer to that peak date, which is September 10th. So things are going to continue to fire up in the Atlantic Basin and the Caribbean. So I am keeping an eye on Hurricane Larry, not an imminent threat to our area, but we'll touch on that system in just a bit. But I am looking at a broad area of low pressure over portions of Central America, it's disorganized. It really doesn't look like much. And the next couple of days is not going to really do much. It's expected to move over the Yucatan Peninsula in the couple of days or so and then enter the Gulf of Mexico. I've been looking at a lot of long range models and I really don't see it amounting to anything, but it's a possibility that it could potentially be a rainmaker for portions of the Gulf region as we head into our Wednesday and Thursday. Again, it has a low chance of development. Right now it's Invest 91. We're investigating this area. It's moving to the northwest at 16 miles per hour with winds of 25 miles per hour. And I do want to show you this model here, just showing the tropical moisture associated with this disorganized system. So again, it is expected to move into the Gulf, but notice as we head into your Wednesday, Thursday, bringing in a good amount of tropical moisture in our area. So this could potentially be a rainmaker for portions of Southeast Louisiana extending into Northern Florida. But a cold front is gonna slide through. I really do think that cold front also, we're looking at upper level winds kind of shredding it apart. So I don't really think, again, it's not gonna amount to much as we head into your Wednesday and Thursday. So Hurricane Larry, really getting its act together. You could clearly see that eye on the visible satellite imagery there. It is moving west-northwest at 16 miles per hour and winds of 100 miles per hour. And it's expected to be our next major hurricane as we head into your Saturday. But again, not a threat to any land. Bermuda is going to have to monitor that storm very closely.